guys welcome back to my channel and if you're new welcome to my channel today's hair sponsor is by the company mega looks hair um yeah this box made me feel like i was you know receiving a present but they sent me over this beautiful highlighted wig y'all slay this install if you're interested on how i actually you know style it and everything, all right y'all so i know y'all see do y'all notice something different Ooh, but, oh my god i look like a naked freaking mole rat like i need to get my lashes done asap but um but yeah y'all i'm not wearing a rope today because i know y'all always see me in a rope chat i don't got no robe on today i look like a naked mole rat damn this wig is heavy one thing about this wig she heavy she thick okay she's thick so i'm gonna actually do like this style that i've seen on instagram you know we're trying to we're trying to find different hairstyles to do and stuff like that so let's go ahead and put the powder underneath the makeup real quick all right you guys so let's go ahead and put this wig on Let's already go ahead and tie our hair back and then you guys know the drill. Um, I'm actually gonna do something a little bit different normally i would take the spray and i would spray it first but um and then cut the lace but i think i want to cut the lace first and then and then try to glue it and i just want to be able to see if i can actually wear this with glueless So, what I'm actually going to do is, I'm probably going to have to cut this whole front part out also because my hairline doesn't really go like that. So, I don't really need this section. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and just spray some spray. All right, so I'm gonna keep going around the whole perimeter and then I'm gonna come back and then and then actually, you know, style the hair because this part is a little bit more tedious, but we're just gonna stick to it, okay?
all right so i somewhat have all the sections already like you know tagged down in a sense some parts are still kind of lifting but we're gonna like conceal everything and like you know the final look and stuff so i'm gonna go back in with my cream foundation and i'm actually just gonna go back in and then just re-tap in those front sections so when i can do the final the final run through everything could be you know blended in Okay, I'm gonna go in with my Tresemme spray. All right, so I know it looks a little bit white right now. So I'm gonna go in a little bit with some alcohol just to tack some of that whiteness off. I don't know if it really made a big difference, but just tack some of that whiteness off. It honestly looks so much more better. Okay, so for this style, I was debating if I, y'all I'm sorry about the talking in the background, my mom talking but i want to see if i was debating if i wanted to do like two pigtails like this and have my hair down or if i just should do like a complete half up half down and i think that's kind of what i'm leaning towards Okay, so I actually am just going to go in and just do the half up, half down. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. So I'm going to just quickly fix my hair. I'm going to just take out the that frontal section and then I'm just going to just... Put in this own section. Yeah, I know I love my baby hair. So we're going to quickly do some baby hairs. I'm just going to do one, two, um, four, like my regular four baby hairs, honestly. So let's just go ahead and do that. I'm gonna go in with my little, I believe this is like a one inch flat iron. I kind of finished my baby hairs. I really love the way that they honestly came out. So now is the part where I'm gonna attempt to do this half up, half down. Like I'll be having issues with these half up, half down. Um, I think I'm just gonna go ahead and use some wax stick just to keep everything together. I 
I'm gonna go in with my hot comb. You can go ahead and just put a little bit of um, spray. Some people just use spray, but me, I didn't want to, I don't want it to look too, too hard and then for it to turn crispy looking. So I'm just going to stick to using the, using um, the wax stick. I'm going to go in with a rubber band. All right, it kind of looks like it's not in the middle. So I'm gonna go ahead and try to see if I can open it up in a sense. And then I'm gonna go back in and just spray a little bit just to take care of the flyaways. So we're gonna go ahead and take a piece. You can take it from, you can take the piece from the ponytail, but the ponytail to me is already like kind of already small. So I am going to take a little section from the tracks. Now I would say if you are going to do this, be careful if you are taking it from the tracks. It would be a little bit more easier if you had, um, if you had curly hair instead. So the tracks wouldn't really show, but this is straight hair. So be careful when you do, um, take it from the track instead of the ponytail. Just make sure that that you cover the track as much as possible, especially if you are gonna be out. And as you guys can see, I'm actually putting some Gossip Bee spray just so everything could be very sleek. And you see after I spray, I do go in with um, the comb just to smooth everything out. When it comes to ending it, just make sure you're at the bottom and then just twist everything and then it should disappear on the bottom piece and then you can go ahead and just do one more spray this is how I'm looking like so far but I'm gonna go ahead and just do my makeup and then I'm gonna come back and show you guys the final oh excuse me y'all I'm here burping like crazy and just come back and show you guys the, the final look period All right, you guys, so you guys cannot tell me I have not been killing it with the freaking installs this week. Like, I've been giving y'all back-to-back, -back, like, slaves. Um, before we just finish up, I kind of want to go in. Y'all know how I am about these strangly ends, so I am going to go in and just cut, like, half an inch, half an inch off just so they can be straight. I would prefer them be straight just so they could look a little bit more fuller in a sense so i'm gonna go in and just do it but yeah this hairstyle is given i actually was gonna go in and you know do some um like really loose curls to it but i'm like i'm really messing with the freaking straight look like the straight look is given what it needs to give like like she's given what needs to be given like the baby hairs is popping the lace is blended <sighs> i just been killing it with the insoles. like it's it's giving what it needed to give okay period now um again this hair is from mega look hair you guys um and honestly you guys i was just saying when i was actually flat ironing the hair this hair is really full now when it comes to like you know frontal wigs and stuff like that y'all know sometimes the densities be off y'all i'm looking at myself in the mirror anyways but yeah y'all know the density be off sometimes so but when it came to this hair i was just saying i'm like damn she is thick she's 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 thick okay like she's giving full and she's really soft like for being bleached like I was saying, all the information about this beautiful unit will be in the description bar down below. And this wig was from Mega Look Hair. Thank you for sending me over this really bomb ass unit. Check the description if y'all want a unit exactly like this and if y'all trying to slay. Um, but yeah, like I'm gonna go ahead and just go admire myself and take some pictures because yeah, I did my makeup in like 30 minutes and anyways but i hope you guys enjoyed this video please make sure you like comment and subscribe we're on the road to 20k so please make sure you guys are subscribed and i'll see you guys in the next one bye